Hey friends, welcome back to my channel. I am so excited to be sharing a huge Costco haul with you guys today. You know I love Costco if you guys have been subscribed to my channel for a while. If you are new here, I would love to have you stick around and subscribe by clicking that red button right down here. And be sure to give this video a thumbs up if you guys enjoy seeing grocery hauls from me. I would love to film more of these videos for you guys. In this video, I am also including a small Sprouts haul and a Trader Joe's haul. So. Stay tuned, and if you guys want to follow me uh, for more everyday life and tips and tricks and just healthy habits, be sure to check out my description box. My Instagram account is linked down there. I share every day over on my Instagram, and I would love to have you follow along there and get to chat with you on my Instagram. So be sure to follow me there. One more thing, uh, I just wanted to mention really quick that I am starting something new. I am going to be shopping at Costco at the beginning of every month, so today is August 1st. You guys will be seeing this August 2nd, and I'm doing this to to A, save money and bulk shop at Costco. So this is for the entire month of August um, from Costco. Guys, um, I have two packages of organic ground turkey. No antibiotics, no artificial ingredients, no preservatives, no gluten, 100% vegetarian fed. Um, this is great for taco bowls. This is great for a substitute if you would prefer this over beef every now and then. I plan to do some breakfast um, like bowls with some scrambled eggs and some yummy sauteed spinach and things like that with the turkey too. So I'm excited to have this. I can always freeze one package um, for the rest of the month too since this is for the whole month of August. And then I bought this big package of Holy Organic Guacamole Minis. I love guacamole, I love avocados, um, and I try to get them into my diet a couple of times a day. Super good omega-3 fats for your body. We have to have omega-3s in our diet, otherwise um, we are not able to get them into our system. Our body does not create omega-3s or omega-6s, so it's really important that we get a good balance of both in our diet. And um, these are just a really simple, quick and easy snack. I can throw them on a salad, I can put them on my eggs. Um, if you like like organic sourdough, um, you could top it with some of this guacamole. Super, super yummy, quick and easy grab and go snack. I love the Chosen Foods Mayo. And there are a couple of reasons for this. Um, most mayo is made with soybean and canola oil. Those are hydrogenated oils and they have been um, significantly shown to increase your risk for cardiovascular issues and also just really poor gut health. So I um, made this switch quite a while ago. This is 100% avocado oil mayo. The ingredients are very, very simple and clean. Um, no yucky oils, no yucky ingredients, no preservatives. Um, so yeah, this is just what I use. Um, we love the Kerrygold butter. This is milk from grass-fed cows. So, so important. Um, but this is nice to get in bulk and have in our fridge or our freezer. I love these Paleo Bites from Costco. Um, these are simple, simple ingredients and these are organic, they're grain free, so they're um, paleo and they are gluten free. Um, so these include honey, coconut, pumpkin seeds, chia seeds and almonds. Again, tons of really good healthy fats. Um, these were like 10 bucks for this big box. Opal, my two year old, loves these for snacks and it makes me so happy uh, because they are such a good option for her. I also love um, sprinkling these over like an acai bowl or um, a yogurt. I love that, super, super yummy. And then we also have some Rouse homemade all natural marinara sauce. This is a first time purchase for me. Um, so I don't normally buy red sauce, normally I will make it myself. Um, but this actually just has such clean ingredients, super convenient, and it's also stored in glass. I really try to avoid plastic as much as possible. Um, so I can reuse these jars, and like I said, this is like super, super clean ingredients. So it's Italian whole peeled tomatoes, which again, um, tomatoes from Italy are absolutely fantastic, so, so good. Uh, the farming practices in um, Italy are much different than they are here in the US. Really good option if you are looking for a better sauce. This does not have sugar, it has no preservatives, no citric acid, nothing like that. Highly recommend. Um, this coconut oil, this is a huge 84 fluid ounce 
container of extra virgin coconut oil or organic virgin coconut oil. And I use this for so many different things in my house. I use it to clean with, I use it for makeup remover, shaving cream. I have a ton of stuff that I use my coconut oil for. You guys can head over to my Instagram. Again, link down below in the description box. I have a whole highlight talking about coconut oil and why I love it. I also bake with this. I add it to our energy bites that I make for our breakfast or snacks. Um, but this was 10 bucks for this huge container. It's currently on rebate. You guys definitely need to pick one up. Um, another thing that was a new find that I'm super excited about are these sprouted pumpkin seeds. Pumpkin seeds contain magnesium, protein, zinc, and iron, all of which are absolutely crucial for the body. I got some of these sprouted pumpkin seeds and they have a touch of sea salt and I'm really excited to incorporate these into my everyday diet. All right, another purchase that I made were these organic um, hemp hearts. These are amazing sources of omega-3s and omega-6s. Um, I am essential fatty acid deficient, so I incorporate a lot of omega-3s into my diet. Um, and this is one way that I can get some of those in a really simple way. So you can add these to salad, cereal, yogurt. Um, I would not recommend cereal, but salad or yogurt are great options or like a fruit bowl. Um, you could also top them on top of like your avocado toast or something like that. Um, super good source of protein. Again, three tablespoons has um, some good fat and then also 10 grams of protein. Um, there's other specs down here. So there's a little bit of potassium and calcium. Uh, magnesium and magnes as far as and folate actually which is also really really important especially if you are pregnant um, so I also grabbed this big bag of organic a perfect a pear a perfect peach blend so this is pear peach pineapple and blueberry and this is organic this was a really really good deal it was eight bucks um, so I will have that for the whole month of August. And then these were on rebate and I love, love, love getting these from Costco. It is the absolute best deal. These are organic acai berry packets. So these are a super fruit, so, so good for you. Have omega-3s, omega-6s, and antioxidants. Um, this was like, I think 10 bucks for a pack of 12, which is like unheard of. It's a really, really good price. Highly recommend. Um, and then I also, grabbed this package of two 100% organic lemon juice, and these are from Volcanic Lemons. Um, again, really good for you. Lots of incredible vitamins and uh, antioxidants in here. So I would highly recommend this if you are looking for an alternative to lemon juice. This is organic just lemon juice. There's no citric acid or preservatives or colors or artificial flavors or ingredients. Okay. I also grabbed a package of the organic creamy peanut butter. This is made with 100% US Valencia peanuts. Super, super important that you choose Valencia peanut butter. I will link an article in my description box as to why that is, but highly recommend this stuff. Super, super good for you and um, a great option. Some of the Bonza chickpea pasta. This is fantastic if you were looking for a substitute for something gluten-free that does not spike blood sugars and ultimately has a um, good source of fiber and protein. I love this stuff. I've been making it for months now and I'm obsessed. It's such a great alternative, much better for you. It's made from chickpeas. I also love the Birch Benders pancake and waffle mix, specifically for waffles. I make my own almond milk and I add it to this instead of using water. I also add a little bit of vanilla extract and you guys, seriously, some of the best pancakes. But what I love most about these um, is the fact that the ingredients are very, very simple and clean. Cassava starch, organic coconut flour, almond flour, um, and then we have some salt, monk fruit, and spice. Super simple and clean. My kiddo loves these and I love them as well. I am a type one diabetic. I'm sure you guys have caught on to my medical alert bracelet here, but um, I also buy these alcohol prep pads. Super cheap. I think this uh, box of four 100 packs, so 400 total, was four bucks. Um, so essentially a dollar a piece for a box, which is really cheap. Um, so I get those from Costco. And then this was a splurge. I do not normally buy these kinds of snacks, but we've been traveling so much that it's been nice to have um, something for Opal on the go. Um, and these are organic 
bunny snacks. There are the uh, bunny grams and then the cheddar bunnies. And again, these are just something that I have on hand for an All right, these are organic string cheeses. These are for Opal. Again, not something that she has every single day, but something that we will eat throughout the month. There's no antibiotics, synthetic hormones, pesticides, or GMOs. She's already had one, that's why it's open. And then we love these mozzarella snacking balls. Um, and these are great for salads or snack. And then I also have some of these farm fresh, organic, free range, medium brown eggs. Normally I will buy pastured or I will buy, um, normally I will buy pastured eggs and I am still a huge advocate for those. However, these were a really good deal at Costco. And again, you have to choose what you spend your money on, especially when you choose high quality food. All of this is high quality food and I chose to still buy organic, but not pastured. So that's a little compromise. And then I got a big bag of organic mixed squash. I have lots of different recipes that I can use this for. You can do a simple like sheet pan dinner. You could steam it. Um, you could also do like a bonza pasta with a red sauce like I showed you guys and you could add some squash super quick and easy. Some organic blueberries and these are actually from Trader Joe's. And then I grabbed a big container of the Driscoll's organic strawberries from Costco. I always buy this huge pack of organic romaine hearts. Um, I always try to buy my produce organic. It's just really important to me that we're consuming clean, fresh foods that have not been sprayed with herbicides, pesticides, and fungicides that are gonna be toxic to the body. Um, so I love getting this. I will eat through this whole bag in like a week and a half. Um, it's crazy, I love my salads. And then this was one of my last finds from Costco that I was super excited to share with you guys. This is a mason jar pantry um, set. So it has four glass canisters in here and they come in three, four different sizes. So there's the smallest one, medium, and then large, and then largest. And this whole package of glass containers, I love that they're glass by the way, there's no toxins, um, was only $16.99. It's currently on rebate. It's normally like $25, I believe. Um, so a really, really good deal if you're looking for some canisters. Okay, now moving on to um, Trader Joe's. I wanted some beets. I love adding beets into our diet. These can be steamed, baked, chopped, um, eaten fresh if you want. Um, but the reason I wanna incorporate beets is because they are great for your gallbladder. If you do not have a gallbladder or you have um, digestive issues with fats, um, I highly, highly recommend incorporating beets into your diet. It will significantly help break down bile. Also, I wanna mention that Beets are actually a really, really incredible natural blood purifier. So they're just really great at eliminating toxins, moving bile, and helping with our overall digestive system. So I grabbed some of these, they're magical. Um, I grabbed a package of Wild Alaskan Sockeye Salmon Filets. This is only 11 bucks for two filets. And then I also got Quite a few perfect bars to be honest with you. I only am showing you guys two because these are the two flavors that I chose, but normally I will pick up like 10 of these for the month or for two weeks, depending on um, how many we go through. This is the new flavor from Trader Joe's. It's the chocolate chip cookie dough with sea salt. These are amazing. These are the cleanest uh, protein bars I've seen on the market. And they are made with superfoods, whole ingredients, and I just, I love them you guys. These are also low glycemic and um, I highly recommend them. So you have to keep these refrigerated or you can enjoy them for up to one week at room temp. Again, 20 plus superfoods, 14 grams of protein, and so, so good. Also low glycemic, I don't know if I said that, but super important for the blood sugars. Um, I grabbed a bag of lemons, a bag of teeny tiny avocados, some organic celery hearts. I love dipping this in peanut butter. Um, I also love doing celery juice just throughout the week whenever I feel like it. Um, let's see, I also grabbed two Synergy Organic Kombuchas. Um, I love the Synergy brand because they're all organic ingredients, but more importantly, they do not add sugar to their, um, to their kombucha. So it's simply watermelon juice, cherry juice, and fresh pressed kiwi and lime juice. So there's no sugar in there, which is really important. There's only nine carbs for eight fluid ounces. I do not drink the whole thing. So this is something that I will have a couple of sips of and then I'll store it in the fridge and I'll just kind of sip it throughout the week. I do not drink a ton of it. Like I said, I only bought two of them. Um, one is for my husband for the week and then one is for me and we just kind of sip it throughout the week. I am gonna show you guys really quick what I got from Sprouts. So I grabbed a 
sweet coconut and I'm going to be making homemade coconut milk. I will show you guys over on Instagram this weekend how to make it from a fresh coconut. I grabbed a package of organic Southwest taco seasoning mix. Again, super clean ingredients and there's no um, sugar in this which is really important to me. I tried the GTS cocoa yogurt for the first time and I am obsessed. It is so, so good. I normally make my own, but I was traveling and um, grabbed this one since I was traveling and it is so, so good. Also love the Stonyfield organic probiotic yogurt. This is plain, it's whole milk, and there are no other ingredients aside from just organic whole milk in there, um, which is great. Some of the Lakanto maple flavored syrup. Normally I do not buy things like this, you guys. I am very rigid about what sugar-free things I buy, but because I am a type one diabetic, I am very picky about what kind of sugars I eat. Um, and then I also grabbed these grain-free taco shells. These are made with avocado oil, super important ingredient. These also have um, only just a couple ingredients, cassava flour, avocado oil, pumpkin seed mill, pumpkin powder, sea salt, psyllium husk powder, and that's it. So these are 100% gluten-free, non-GMO, so good. And then last but not least, we love, love the Simple Mills products. These are the crunchy double chocolate chip cookies, and these are made with whole food ingredients. The only ingredients listed are right here. Um, there is no sugar aside from uh, coconut sugar, which is amazing. So um, highly recommend this brand if you guys have not checked it out. I also grabbed a big bag of the Kirkland almond flour. Um, normally I would look for organic, but I have not been able to find organic, so this is what's going to do. But I do all of my baking and cooking um, with almond flour. So super good deal at Costco. This bag was $12.99. All right, friends, that is the end of today's haul. I have felt like I was talking forever, so if you made it to the end of this video, thank you, I appreciate you. I would love for you guys to follow me over on Instagram. Be sure to click that link in the description box down below and follow me over there. And again, if you have not subscribed already, click that red button. I would love for you to be a part of my family on YouTube here, and I will see you guys in my next video. Bye, friends.